Hello, hello, hello. As you can see from the title of my video, say hey, Aria. Say hey. As you can see from the title of my video, it says so long, bye-bye to my health issues. Yes. So I know y'all been seeing my post about um, what's been helping me with my fatigue. Where did you get that from? That No, that's not the cup that I was talking about. Where did you get that from? Oh, okay. I didn't know she had that much apple juice left. But um, I've been posting about what's been helping me with my fatigue and my and burning out and um, a lot of other health issues that I've had over, I want to say the past three or four years. Um, hey, Auntie, I see you watching. Look. You've been MIA. I know why, but I'm glad to see you back on Facebook. Love you. Um, but yeah, I've been dealing with health issues. And you know, a lot of us deal with health issues and we don't really talk about it. I don't know why, um, but guess what? I need to help. So I've tried a lot of different products and um, had so many different diagnoses only to get medicine from doctors that did not work for me. Or I would go try some things on my own that didn't work. So I finally found something. But before I talk about that, I just want to sh um, share some of the health issues that I've had. Um, so I've had thyroid problems for, I want to say, about maybe the last four years. And I found out that um, the thyroid problems was the reason why I was having... Um, miscarriages at one point i was like severely fatigued um i was dealing with in, insomnia not being able to sleep um what else um who hair loss uh man it's just a lot of different things so i tried so many products over the years um detoxing i've tried uh, I've tried so many different diets. I've tried eliminating things um, from my diet. I've tried not having sugar. I mean, so many things. But if you don't know, hyperthyroidism, that's what they told me I had. Your thyroids are here and it produces a lot of the hormone for your body. So with me having hyperthyroids, I was overproducing hormone, which caused anxiety, um, Sweating. I used to sweat a lot, like especially under my arms. I hated that. Um, it's just my body did not regulate and do things properly, and I never understood why. And something so simple, and they check it through your blood, and um, that's what it was. So anyway, what I use to beat my fatigue and my burnout, like I, I could sleep eight hours and be burnt out by nine or ten o'clock. It felt like I never got any sleep. Um, I had leaky gut. Um, I used to deal with irritable bowel syndrome where you don't go to the bathroom properly. Um, and like I said, lack of sleep. It was just a lot of different issues. And it's small things like that where people feel like they could just go take a Red Bull or an energy pill and that's it. And that's not the case. Like you, when your body is starting to do things, you have to pay more attention to it and be more aware of what's going on. Cause you know, your body, you know, your body. So when I started to notice some things that were just not normal for me, like even certain things that I would eat and then I realized that um, it started bothering me. Um, and then I found that I had, I was sensitive to a lot of food. So you just have to pay attention to what goes on with your body. I'm not a doctor, but I just wanted to share because I feel like this product that I'm using can help a lot of people with just the, the simple things. And it's something you can use every day. If you wanna lose weight, um, if you want to have more energy, you want to grow your hair out. Like I said, my hair was thinning. It's internal. So when you have something going on with your body, it's always something internally. And it can take small changes um, just to see a change and feel better. So anyway, this is what I use. This is what I use. I don't know if y'all be able to see it because the light. Okay, so 
the it works greens y'all can't really see it because of the light but um put the blind down a little bit the it works greens which is still not showing ah there it is it works greens blend and it alkalize balance and detoxify your body now um i know a lot of you have heard about it works and it works is not just about wraps they have other products that can really help you physically and mentally because this really helps me a lot so um i decided to give the greens a try because i heard a lot about it especially for a lot of people that deal with health issues like um even diabetes um things like lupus it doesn't cure these things but it helps like suppress a lot of things even people that have dealt with cancer i mean all things are curable naturally so when you do something natural for your body it always helps like not medicine not man-made medicine everybody always wants to turn to antibiotics and this pill and that pill and they don't help they don't help i've been there i've done that i've tried every pill i've tried every iron pill i've tried every vitamin i've tried every everything in the book so i'm really passionate about this or i would not be on here live sharing with you guys what i use but the it works greens it's the chocolate blend there are other flavors i think it's berry and orange but i love the chocolate because when i post about it and i talk about it, it i use it with this coconut tea it's coconut tea which is also good for hair growth and um, things like that. I blend it with this coconut tea and I, it tastes like hot chocolate. Like I got a cup right now because I didn't drink it this morning. So I just made a cup of it and um, it tastes just like hot chocolate. And also for people that struggle with coffee too, I'm sorry if I'm all over the place, but I'm trying to get this out next time I have some notes. But I was an avid coffee drinker too. And then I noticed how coffee made me feel every morning. So not only would I be burnt out in the mornings, but I would drink coffee and be really done by the afternoon. So when I started drinking this, I was like, this is it for me. So this has replaced my coffee and it tastes like hot chocolate. It's so good. Now, everybody doesn't drink it like this because, um, I mean, you can add it to almond milk. I've tried that. You can add it to almond milk or a shake or whatever you want to um, get it in, but for me, I prefer to drink it like this because this is like having my coffee in the morning or like right now at 3 o'clock, I'm having it as an afternoon thing, like a cup of hot chocolate. So this is also good for winter time because if you love to drink hot chocolate, then you can have this and it's healthy for you. So not only are you able to get a healthy alternative in, but you are detoxifying your body. It's an easy detox. It's easy on your body because I've had... I've done detoxes where it can be really like, it can do a lot to you. So this is a light detox and that's why you can use this daily and just clean out your body, alkaline your, alkalize your body, stop, alkalize your body and balance out your body as long as you drink a lot of water with this and it'll be really good for you. I've noticed that it's, it also has um, curved a lot of my cravings, like especially for sweets because I struggle with having like i'm a sweet i'm a sweets junkie i love oreos and i used to eat a lot of dark chocolate and um i just like snacks like i like snacks and sweets and stuff like that so i'm quick to pick that up but i noticed that this curves my craving for sweets and it also curves my cravings for lattes because I like iced lattes. So I would still get that in the afternoons and now I don't want it. So there's a lot of things that I don't desire to eat anymore. I don't even, and like, I'm, I've never been a soda drinker, but I don't even want to drink soda. Like the little bit of soda that I, like I tried to drink a soda, I think yesterday I bought a whole Pepsi and I just could not handle it. I drank a little bit because I was real thirsty in the Walmart line. Y'all know how that is. You in line and you just grab a soda or something because that's all they have they don't even have healthy options for you to grab and that's the problem today that is the problem they have all the unhealthy things right there for you to grab but if you want to find if you want to find the healthy options you got to go search around the store okay i'm almost done 
I'm almost done. <laughs> But um, I just grabbed the soda because I was real thirsty. And I don't like Aquafina water. And that's all they have in the line, too. So I didn't grab that. And I tried to drink the soda, and I couldn't. So this had, I've been using this for about three weeks. Almost a month I've been using this. No, it's been a month. It's been a month since I've been using it. And when I say I noticed a change, even in my skin and my nails, I post about that, too. Not only am I taking a hair, skin, nail vitamin, but... I noticed that this is one of the signs where when your body is trying to tell you something, it also shows in your nails. And for me, I've always had really strong, healthy nails. And then I noticed that I was starting to get a lot of like hangnail and my cuticles. It just wasn't looking right. I posted a picture on my Facebook already like earlier this week or last week. But everything, I just noticed a lot of things was not right. And I knew I had to do something. It's always right to do something when... You're noticing it before it gets too late. And then you have to take drastic measures. And I didn't want to do that. And I was just tired of feeling the way that I was feeling. I was always foggy. Like I couldn't focus. My like being burnt out and fatigued, which would cause me not to want to do anything throughout the day, but just lay down and sleep. That's how it was for me until I started taking these greens. So when you see me post this on my Facebook, it is serious and I am just the messenger. Like you have a lot of people that get on there just trying to sell, but I am here to help. And if something is helping me, I want to share what is helping me because I know a lot of people need this product. A lot of people need this and it's something so simple. You don't have to go out and buy this and that and a million other things to feel better. You can feel better with one thing, with one product. So, um, let me open this blind back up. But you can feel better with this one product. So, like I said, I got a testimony. Because I'm happy, y'all. I found something that worked for me because over the years, I mean, after trying so many products, you feel like you just want to give up. You really feel like you want to give up. So, I just wanted to share, and I cannot stress enough the energy that this gives me. And for you, for those of you that just popped on, I just seen some of you pop on. I'm talking about the It Works Greens. I have the chocolate blend. I have to show it this close because um the lighting in the back. But it alkalizes and it balances and it detoxifies your body and it curves a lot of things. It helps you lose weight. Uh, you get a lot of energy. It helps. You conquer fatigue and burnout, especially for my moms or even the ones that just work all the time. Like it's the little things that this thing, this this product does, and it really has helped me. It really, it has really helped me. So if your girl, give me this, give it here. So if your um, no, oh. Excuse me, y'all. <laughs> this is real life. So this is why this product has helped me too. Because if I'm burnt out, I can't keep up with my kids. Okay, Ashley, I see your comment. So this will really help you. Because I've also recommended this to some other people. That is dealing with high blood pressure. And it gives you, like, this is full of the nutrients you need. And if you're not a person that likes to eat fruits and vegetables like who really gets in eight servings of fruits and vegetables every day not me but i know i need it but i don't so i um you get all your servings of fruits and vegetables in this too um which is really good because i've tried other green powdered things i really don't know how to explain it I should have kept all the products that I've tried over the years trying to fix my thyroids. And this one product after so many years has helped me so much. But I've tried so many different things like this right here is a, this is hemp protein and fiber. Like I've tried so many different things that it's like I will feel it. You sleepy? So it's like I would feel it. No, it's not costly. It's um, it's $33 and this is a month's supply. But I tell you, I tried to be cheap. This is worth it for me because 
my health is worth it right now. I have been going through entirely too much health-wise. And my concern was being healthy for not only myself, but for my children and for my husband. Like, I have other people to consider when it comes to my health. And it was just time for me to take care of myself. But this is $33. It's a month's supply. And it's so worth it. It's so worth it. I cannot stress it enough. Like, I used to complain about being tired all the time, having headaches all the time, and everything. Yes, I am, Katrina. I am. Just for this product. <laughs> um, I am. But um, I I cannot, sh like, you guys, y'all have no idea. And then, especially when I, let me get her some apple juice. But especially when I find out that I was dealing with hyperthyroids um, and I did my research and then I did my research to find out how um, how the thyroids pretty much control your whole body. It's like your second brain. So if you're not taking care of yourself and your thyroid levels are not good, like you're not balanced for as far as your thyroids your body is just going to be out of whack until you do something about it. And all it takes is a small change in your diet. That's all it takes. I didn't have to go on. I didn't have to go on this full on diet and cut all this stuff out of my diet. And I just took it steps at a time. And I started like eliminating the soda or I started um, cutting down on my sugar intake or, um, I started cutting down on my sugar intake. Dairy products, I found out, like, having hyperthyroidism, I couldn't have um, dairy products because it affects the way the hormone produces. Um, what else? But when you're dealing with thyroids, I probably should share this on my Facebook page, but when you're th dealing with thyroid problems, it, it's also um, sh kind of showing that you have a deficiency in vitamins. So you're not getting enough nutrients and vitamins in your diet. So I also stress that you should take a vitamin. Like for me, I take hair, skin, nail vitamins, which is also why it works. And it is working awesome. It is really working out for me. So that when you like, so I think when anybody's having health problems, you should just automatically assume that you're having thyroid problems. Ashley, um, I can see some information. I'm a distributor, so you can get them. You can get them from me. Um, but this will really help. It suppresses a lot of health issues. And if you take it up a step every time while you're taking the greens, drink a lot of water, start eating a little more fruits and vegetables, just change your diet. I don't believe in that whole full-on diet thing. Like, Because me personally, I can't do it. I cannot cut sugar completely out of my diet. Like, I can't do it. I'm a real person. You got some people out there that are strong and that can do that? Not me. So, this also helps with my sugar intake as well. Because, like I said, it tastes like hot chocolate when I mix it with the coconut tea, which I got from Walmart. Coconut tea and with the chocolate greens, it tastes just like hot chocolate. And that helps me get my sugar craving in for the morning or the afternoon and I feel great and then I knowing that it's healthy for me and it's going to give me that boost and give me the vitamins that I need yes so I think I'm going to start sharing more about thyroid problems because a lot of people don't know like especially a lot of moms uh yeah I'll be at church tomorrow Ashley um but especially for a lot of moms and you're dealing with, um, if you're dealing with fatigue or like I said, the burnout, you're losing your hair, your nails are brittle, um, maybe you're always tired, you're short of breath. All of that stuff can lead back to thyroid problems. And I, can, I would recommend this one product plus a good vitamin to start dealing with everything and then you take everything else a step at a time so i think that's it i think that is all katrina if you're still on here 
you saying your hormones fluctuate, your thyroids fluctuate? Is that what you're saying? If you're still here. He should more have her third well, looking for better ways. Yes, Bambi, yes. Okay, I sure will, because I've done a lot of research on hyperthyroid once I found out about it. And you just popped on, but I was sharing like the way that I found out that I was dealing with hyperthyroids. I didn't even know where my thyroid was here. I didn't even know what a thyroid was. I'm thinking people are gonna automatically think it's in your thighs or something. <laughs> But um, I didn't find out until I about hyperthyroidism until I had about I think I had two miscarriages. I had two miscarriages, and I didn't know I didn't understand what it was coming from. And then I found out through a blood test that I was dealing with hyperthyroids, and that answered a lot of things for me. It it just it made me it I understood why I couldn't sleep properly. I understood. The reason for headaches and anxiety and sweating a lot. And my sweating has really, I sweat a lot. I used to sweat a lot under my arms, just a, a little bit. I could step outside, it's over. So for me, I would always wear big shirts. Or if I'm put in a position where I have to be in front of people, like for my people on here that go to church with me, <laughs> um, just knowing that I'm going to have to get up and sing, you know, my body feels that little bit of anxiety or nervous and it makes me sweat. And I used to sweat a lot. And it has also helped with that. So, Bambi, I will definitely share everything. Yep. Yes, I also have dairy issues. And I've been asking doctors about it. And it makes sense. Oh, my God. Yes, I sweat a lot, Lord. <laughs> yes. And, girl, listen. It's embarrassing. And I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. But once I did more research, it has really helped. And th taking these greens has really helped me as well. And it has suppressed um, sweating under my arms. So, <laughs> so I just wanted to share this product with y'all because it's really, it's really been helping me with everything. Like, I didn't believe it. Oh, thank you, Katrina. <laughs> I didn't, you know, you hear the hype. You want to go play the bubby? You hear the hype about certain products. And then once you keep trying different products, you'll be like, Oh, that didn't help. That didn't help me either. That didn't help me either. So then you want to give up. But when you find that one thing that has helped you with everything, I have no choice but to share. I'll feel bad if I don't share something that's helping me out. Just like spreading the word, you know, of Jesus and what he's done for me. If I don't share what God has done for me, which is this product that has helped me, um, yeah. Yeah. So I'm being the messenger. So I think that's it. I just wanted to share. It's been long overdue, but I just wanted to wait a month to see what it really does for me. And then I could really, you know, get on here and explain everything. But I'm going to do a video more with more detail, explaining the hyperthyroids and then explaining how the products have helped. And what's in it that has helped my thyroid levels and my hormones <clears throat> balance out. So, please bring a jar clean and use dry fire. No, Katrina. See, I went to Walgreens and I went to Walgreens and tried to buy stuff. I've been at Walmart trying to buy stuff. I've been at Target trying to buy stuff. I've, um, I've gone to... Places like Whole Foods, and I've tried to buy things, and it doesn't help. I've even been as expensive as buying stuff for $55 for a little jar of something, hoping that it would help me. That's how desperate I was. Like, I was willing to spend the money to deal with what I was going through. Because I was just, I'm tired of going through health problems. Like, so many health issues. So... I will definitely share with you, Katrina. Thank God for you. I needed this. Yes, Bambi. I'll message you if you don't mind or if you want to send me a message. I could give you more information, but this has really helped. So for those of you that know how that hyperthyroidism or dealing with thyroid imbalances, this is definitely for you. This is a testimony. I mean, even if I stop using the product, I doubt that I will, but this is definitely a testimony for me because it was starting to get rough, especially after I had my, 
had her, which she's a year old now. And after I had her, like everything, it got everything got worse for me. Yes, hyperthyroid. Yeah, you saying hypo? You have hypothyroidism, Katrina. <clears throat> and I know hypo could be. I mean, they're both bad, hyper and hypo. But I, I think hypo is worse after doing research. I see that hypo is definitely worse, um, and that it, that's when you're not producing enough. But either way, you don't want to be, be producing too much hormone, and you don't want to be producing little hormone. You just need your body to balance out, and that's what these greens... Oh, okay. Yeah, you did say it fluctuates. Ooh, so you really be going through it. <laughs> you really go through it. Oh, my gosh. This will really help you then. This will really help you. But hyperthyroidism sucks. It really does. It really does. And a lot of people aren't... What's Major? Come get your sister pacifier for me. Um, okay, Ashley. Yes. <laughs> yes. But um, you know, a lot of people are it's just it's about being educated. That's all it is. It's just about educating yourself yeah. and learning to Can you go get her pacifier for me? What y'all doing? <laughs> It's just about educating yourself and um, just staying alert of what's going on with your body, like I said. And something so little, y'all, I would have never, you couldn't have told me that I was going through, whew, you couldn't have told me I, was going, I wasn't going through some kind of midlife crisis when my body started acting up. <laughs> you couldn't have told me I wasn't going to go through something serious. Like, I thought I had everything in the book and I was waiting for the doctor to even tell me that I had a lot of things going on but just this one thing and like I said it's all about educating yourself learning what's going on and then treating it before it yes it yeah dairy causes inflammation so not only with the thyroid problems are you dealing with inflammation but yep because what I've read is that with hyperthyroids you should avoid dairy. You should avoid um, caffeine. Oh, man. My phone is dead, y'all. I can't even look on my phone. You should avoid... Um, dairy is the number one thing in caffeine. So, for me, I used to eat a lot of eggs, a lot of cheese, a lot of milk. Um, what else? And then dairy is in a, in a lot of stuff. Um... And then the caffeine, it was the coffee for me. I would drink a cup of coffee every morning, sometimes two cups of coffee, because I love coffee. So I even went on the search trying to find a healthy coffee alternative, which I finally found. Thank you, Jesus. Not only with the greens, but there's another healthy option that I found that's called keto coffee um, that's actually healthy for you. Because I was like, oh, my God, I can't cut out my coffee. I don't drink soda. Lord, can I keep my coffee? That's... <laughs> <laughs> two cups a day yep and one time i was worse like i used to drink three cups a day sometimes you know that was just my way of dealing with certain things if i was stressed out or whatever i was like oh i need a cup of coffee and that's what i would get but now i don't even desire i tried to drink a cup of coffee this morning and it made me so sick like i tried to drink a regular cup of coffee this morning and it made me sick it gave me a headache and my stomach was hurting and I felt like some acid reflux. So, yeah. So, I'm thankful for the, the greens that I take now. I'm so thankful for it. So, but yes, a lot of different foods cause inflammation. And then if you're dealing with the hormone problems, thyroid problems, it just makes it worse. So, but... I cannot say it enough. It's just all about educating yourself. It's all about going to get checked out. It's not about trying to figure out things on your own. But sometimes those doctors, they don't, you know, it took me a few blood tests to even find out that I was dealing with um, thyroid problems. It took a few blood tests and two miscarriages. And that's how I found out that I had lost two babies because of, um, my hormones so my body couldn't function properly to hold the babies so 
yeah it can get really serious it can get really serious so i think that's it for now if y'all don't if y'all have any questions for me about the greens that i'm using or if you would like more information you can inbox me or comment on this video especially if you're watching this later i just wanted to get on here and share like it was just it's been on my heart today to really share like i'm like i'm not about just selling a product i'm about things that work for me because I know what I've been through health wise especially in my last pregnancy yes ma'am you are welcome but I know what I've been through especially in my last pregnancy so yeah so I guess that's it but if you want the recipe that I use because this coconut tea that I use is everything and even for people that say they don't drink tea, this coconut tea is really good. And I found it at Walmart. So this is also really healthy for you too. And if you mix the, the greens with this coconut tea, it is everything, y'all. It tastes like hot chocolate, I promise. It tastes like hot chocolate. It's so good. So this is my sugar. Um... Um, this is my sugar for the day. Like it gives me my chocolate that I used to like to eat a lot. Then it's like my coffee. So that's it for now. But if you are interested, please inbox me or comment below. If you have any kind of imbalance, um, you're dealing with diabetes. If you know somebody that is dealing with, um, um, fatigue, in, insomnia, headaches, diabetes, high cholesterol, um, thyroid problems. What else have I had? Food sensitivities. I've, I have food sensitivities as well. Um, even if you're not getting your, your eight servings of fruits and vegetables, this can help you this can help you so it's just it's always taking the small steps like i said it takes you to make one small change not a big change one small change first because when you try to do big things and make drastic changes especially when it comes to your body and your body is not used to it guess what you're going to do your body is going to react you're not going to going to deal with the reaction so you're going to go back to what your body is telling you to give which could be the soda, which could be the dairy, which could be the coffee, could be the sugar, the cookies, whatever it is that your body is used to. When you try to take that away just instantly, it doesn't work like that. And then you have to fight even harder to conquer whatever it is that you're going through. So if you make small steps first, small steps first, two scoops of this a day, however you want to make it. Oh yes, Katrina. And you already you're already full of energy. So to have some real energy, yes. <laughs> Not even by December. Because I didn't even share how fast this worked for me. But I took it the same day that I the first day that I took this, I noticed the change. Cause like I said, my problem was being burnt out and dealing with fatigue by nine or ten o'clock. And by 12 o'clock, I was done. Like 12 o'clock in the afternoon, I felt like I had done, ran up and down the street 20 times and did a full hour workout. That's how I used to feel like I had done so much by 12 o'clock. So that first day that I took this, it was like four o'clock in the afternoon and I was still ready to go. I'm like, I'm not tired, no headaches. I noticed it the first day. It worked the first day for me. And ever since then, this has been it. Only time that I've noticed that it prop this always works, but you know, when the woman is going through that time of the month, your body is working overtime. So I did notice that I was a little bit tired later in the afternoon, not by 12 o'clock, but later in the afternoon, I noticed that I was tired, but only because it was that time, you know, like the, the usual stuff that comes along with that. But other than that, it's good. It has helped with my skin and everything. My nails are like back. Like, yeah. So, we'll talk, Katrina. 
we will talk, but let me go because I feel like I'm rambling now. But I, when I find something that I love and I want to share with everybody, I just have to, especially when it comes to health issues. Your health is no joke and um, nobody should take anything lightly when it comes to yourself. You're supposed to love yourself first before you can love and take care of everybody else. So do what you got to do for yourself and take care of yourself. You are worth the investment. Bye, Katrina. You are worth the investment for sure. So a little $20, $30 here and there, we're going to spend that on food, and we're okay with it. But when it comes to buying something that will help us in the long term and, you know, we'll be good, people don't want to do that. But, yeah. So I'm out. Just had to share. Hope you guys are having a blessed, what's today, Tuesday? A blessed Tuesday. <clears throat>